welcome to gcd technologies difference between regression testing and retesting regression testing test execution level as per istqb syllabus regression testing is a test type generally we say test types are functional testing and non functional testing in non functional testing we have several types several subtypes performance testing usability testing reliability testing etc generally we say test types are functional testing and non functional testing but as per istqb syllabus test types four test types first one functional testing second one non functional testing third one change related testing retesting and regression testing is called change related testing next fourth one structural testing okay as per istqb regression testing is test type uh, in system testing point of view this regression testing can be done in all test levels we are taking system testing independent testers conduct testing at a system testing level system testing point of view regression testing test execution level retesting and regression testing both are combined difference is there but both are combined see <clears throat> difference between regression testing and retesting regression testing and retesting are type of test to be executed on modified software builds regression testing can be regression testing can be done in parallel with retesting retesting is of high priority so it's done before the regression testing regression testing test cases can be automated and retesting test cases can't be automated what is regression testing regression testing is defined as a type of software testing to confirm that uh, a recent program or code change has not adversely affected existing features regression testing is nothing but a full or partial section of already executed test cases which are re-executed to ensure the existing functionality is working fine next what is retesting retesting to ensure that the defects which were found and posted in the earlier build were fixed or not in the current build retesting is running the previously failed test cases again on the new software to verify whether the defects posted earlier are fixed or not next regression testing versus retesting important points regression testing is done for passed test cases retesting is done only for failed test cases but both are combined we execute regression and retesting test cases in parallel regression testing is done for passed test cases already passed test cases uh, to confirm any uh, modifications are introduced or not based on the defect fixes retesting is done only for failed test cases next point regression testing checks for unexpected side effects retesting make sure that the original fault has been corrected next the purpose of regression testing is that new code changes should not have any side effects to existing functionalities retesting is done on the basis of the defect fixes uh, one example uh, suppose we, we executed some test cases on software build 2 in module 1 test case 1 test case 2 test case 3 4 5 6 module 2 
test case 7, 8, etc. In module 1, test case 4 failed. Uh, on next build, build 3, executing the test case 4, last time failed test case on modified build is retesting. Next, Test case 3, test case 5 passed last time, but based on this defect fix, any side side impacts introduced or not, we need to check. Suppose test case 3, 4, 5, these three test cases are related, functionality related. Uh, in order to confirm that, we need to conduct our uh, test case 3 and test case 5 regression testing. For example, in module 2, test case 7 passed, but test case 4, just assume, test case 4 and test case 7 are related uh, in order to make sure uh, we need to execute test case 7 also, regression testing. So final on modified build, test case 4 is retesting. Test case 4 last time failed, this time retesting. Next, test case 3, test case 4, test case 7. Regression testing. Test case 3, test case 4, test case 7 last time passed. But these test cases are related to Last time failed test case, test case 4. So, in order to uh, confirm if any side impacts introduced or not, we need to check for that regression testing. See, retesting on failed test case, retesting for last time failed test case, regression testing for last time passed test cases, but uh, these are related to last time failed test case. This is about regression and retesting. Uh, first retesting, then regression testing. That is the sequence. Regre uh, first retesting, then regression testing. But these are combined. We execute retesting and regression testing test cases in parallel. Thank you.